okay good morning children okay you children had problem in division of a multinomial by a multinomial so i'll be taking few questions based on this to explain you this how to divide a multinomial by a multi suppose we have divide a square plus 7a plus 12 and we have to divide by a plus 4 the first thing that we need this is called the dividend yeah this is a square plus 7a plus 12 is called the dividend and we have to divide by a plus 4 so this is the divisor okay the very first thing so first see children that this is a an expression an expression in one variable okay it's an expression in a a to the power 2 you have you sh the terms should be arranged in this manner first the highest order highest power the term containing the highest power a to the power 2 then a to the power 1 and then the constant if you don't get the terms arranged in this sequence you have to first arrange them yes the first step is to arrange the terms of the dividend as well as the divisor both in the descending powers of the variable yeah it's uh, yes descending power is more convenient so we do it in descending power of the variable like power 2 then power 1 and then this constant okay like like marriages are uh, take place in the first uh, member with the uh, child with the highest age is married first and then comes the marriage of this and then then this okay so same way you have to the first step is to arrange them in descending powers of the variable if it is in one variable okay this is an algebraic expression in one variable this is also both the dividend and now let us see the first term of this and the first term of this let us equate them how will you get a a multiplied by what gives you a square a multiplied by so you'll write a over here yes a multiplied by a gives you a square okay but this plus 4 was also there in the divisor in the divisor yes so this 4 will also be multiplied by this children make a mistake of not multiplying this by a so this is the common error please be careful plus 4 into a is plus 4a like we say na uh, like this is the dulha in a yes and this uh, these are the baratis so whatever this dulha is going to eat this baratis will also eat the same thing okay so they have to be fed otherwise they will become angry if you will not feed them they will become angry so let us whatever we are feeding this we will feed the same thing to this also that means a into a and a into 4 yes if you will not not do this they will become angry okay so it's always a a plus 4 multiplied by a gives a square plus 4a should take care that whatever the sign if it is plus a square i have to multiply by a if it is minus a square would have it would have been minus a square here then i will multiply by minus a the same sign as the number we have to bring it here yes after multiplying we could should get the same sign of this yeah now comes the as we do in division which is subtraction in subtraction uh, yes we just change the sign of the lower expression so this the first term this is this cancels and this cancels now this is married okay now comes 7a minus 4a this becomes plus 3a and another one more term we are going to copy here that is 12 okay now a now again now a has to become equal to 3a how will you get what with what you should multiply a to get plus 3a yes plus 3a you multiplied by plus 3 yes you are multiplying by plus 3 to get plus 3a this is plus 3 clear so again the same thing now 3 into a is 3a so we'll write plus 3a here 3a here and plus 4 yes remember this is a barati and we cannot annoy him yeah he should not be angry 4 into 3 don't forget this to multiply plus 4 into plus 3 that gives you plus 12 yes and then again subtraction subtraction again you might just subtract by sub while subtracting we change the sign of the lower expression so plus 3a minus 3a cancels plus 12 minus 12 cancels 
so what is the quotient here the quotient is a plus 3 and the remainder we are getting as 0 there is no remainder left nothing is left as a remainder ok again I am just repeating this is the dividend and the divisor both have to be arranged in the descending power of the variable yes descending power means highest power the term containing the highest power then the one below that and then the constant term and same here it has to be arranged it cannot be divided 4 plus a no a plus 4 yes a square plus 12 plus 7 and no you have to arrange it first yeah and then how do we do this a into a is a square plus 4 will also yes this is a barati yeah yes so plus 4 will also eat a a plus 4 into a you have to do in fact yes to so a square plus 4a again then subtraction this cancels the aim is to cancel the first term all the time yeah we bring it equal so that the first term is cancelled now we have brought a a square here because we have to cancel this a square then subtraction this is subtracted plus 3a and then the another term as we do in division now 3a now a you have to bring this equal to 3a with what will you multiply 8 so that you get plus 3a only not minus 3a okay plus 3a whatever the sign is there we have to bring the same sign here so we will multiply by plus 3 so a into plus 3 is plus 3a plus 4 into 3 is plus 12 yes so again when we have a plus 4 into 3 getting my point a plus 4 into 3 we have done not only a into 3 but 4 will also consume this 3 yeah so this becomes 0 now again subtraction and this becomes 0 this is the first step in some questions you may not find these dividend arranged in a sequence in the descending power of a x or y or whatever the variable is the first step you have to always take care of okay now let us do another sum yes now this is another one let us do this now see first see dividend is arranged in the descending powers of the variable highest power 3 then power 2 then power 1 and then power 0 which is a constant constant means power is 0 and here this is also arranged power 1 and this this is a binomial and this is a 1 2 3 4 it is a multinomial okay now 2a first term has to become equal to first term now with what should i multiply don't bother about this right now yes this is the main concern this and this they are the primary ones these are the baratis they are the dulha and dulhan okay bride and the bridegroom okay 2a and 6a cube so how will you multiply 2a with what yes 2 into what is 6 2 into 3 is 6 and a into what is a cube a into a square is a cube now see 3 2 is 6 a into a square is a cube 6 a cube okay and plus 6 a cube of course 6 a cube now this will also consume this yes so minus 3 into 3 is minus 9 a square minus 3 into 3a square is minus 9a square now this again comes subtraction in which we change the sign of the lower expression this cancels this is married now now comes the chance of this whatever is left minus a square plus 9a square becomes what plus 9 minus a square becomes plus 8a square and next one comes down minus 10a okay now again the same thing now this has to become equal to this we have to multiply with what number should i multiply 2a to get 8a squared now this is the primary this is the first term now yeah first term of this has been it has been uh, eliminated now comes the chance of this now 2a into what is 8a squared to 4 are 8 so we'll write plus 4 what else what else 4 to the 8a now so but we want a square so plus 4a clear plus 4a now now let us multiply 2 4 are plus 8a square and plus 4a into minus 3 is what minus 12a again and again i am saying this is very important don't leave this this is the only mistake that children do that they don't multiply minus 3 with 4 which is very very important again 
subtraction we subtract yes we subtract means changing the sign this is done okay now minus 10a plus 12a becomes plus 2a and next chances of minus 3 comes down yes this minus 3 comes down yes as we do in division now 2a you have to get 2a with what should i multiply so that i with what number should i multiply so that it get the same number so that is plus 1 yeah so you get plus 2a and minus 3 into plus 1 is minus 3 in some cases maybe you don't get the other term same then we leave that as remainder yes again comes the type subtraction yes this cancels now minus 3 plus 3 also cancels everything is done now what is the quotient quotient is 3a square plus 4a plus 1 and the remainder is 0 here you can apply division mm -hmm. algorithm to check your sum also you know division what is division algorithm that quotient into divisor plus mm -hmm. remainder is equal to dividend if you multiply this quotient multiplied by 2a minus 3 that is a divisor you and you add the remainder to it remainder is 0 in this case so just multiply this and this you will get this expression dividend so that means you are correct you can check your sum okay now the third type that comes is now suppose you get x cube minus 1 divided by x minus 1 now you will think what is there so in this case children very simple way we will do the same process but since we have the term x to the power 3 and a constant term here we don't have x to the power 2 and x to the power 1 yeah so let us keep them as 0 x square don't keep it as only x square that means 1 x square which is not there so keep them as 0 x square and 0 x so that we have each term okay the power is x to the power 3 or you may leave empty spaces here two empty spaces and minus 1 but it is always safe to write 0 x square plus 0 x minus 1 same thing now they are arranged now they are arranged this is also arranged now let us multiply let us divide x how will you get x cube with what should you multiply x to get x cube you will multiply by x square you multiply by x square you get x cube and minus 1 into x square is minus 1 x square we don't write 1 here but it's okay yes if you write then also it's not now you subtract so that means when you are subtracting the sign of the lower term changes lower yeah so now this goes yes now 0 and plus 1 is that gives you x square plus 1 x square or only x square and 0x 0x let it be 0x okay now from x how will you get x square multiply by what plus x see plus x you multiply by plus x you get x square yes and minus 1 into x don't forget this again minus 1 into x is minus 1x okay again subtraction minus this becomes plus yes this cancels now 0 plus 1 is 1x again and then comes minus 1 now from x x that means you will multiply by by what plus 1 so 1x that is x 1x and minus 1 into plus 1 is minus we don't write minus uh, this x 1 with x and minus 1 minus into plus is minus 1 sorry minus 1 and then again you subtract children again you subtract this cancels minus 1 plus 1 cancels so your answer is so there is no need of quotient is x square plus x plus 1 and the remainder is 0 clear now you can check your answer if you multiply x square plus x plus 1 multiplied by x minus 1 you will get x cube minus 1 understood when we have we when the terms are missing in between of the power make them 0 x square and 0 x and then proceed in the same way as we do in division you will not face any problem now these were the sums which were related to what related to only one variable expression the algebraic expressions were in only one variable now what if algebraic expression is in two variables now let us take this this is an algebraic expression x square 
minus 2xy and plus y square and you have to divide by x. There are two variables x as well as y. So how do we arrange them? We arrange them in 1. Yes, like x to the power 2, like this, x to the power 2, then x to the power 1, the term containing x to the power 1, in descending power of x or you can say ascending power of y. Yes, in descending power s, x to the power 2 in y, of one variable, x to the power 2 term containing then x to the power 1 and then the, this is a constant for you can say it is a y, it is an ascending power of y or descending power of x, any one. You can write y square minus 2xy plus x square then this has to be arranged same way but it is always safe to start with x square x to the power 2 minus 2xy plus y. You cannot write plus y square and then minus 2xy please ok. You have to write x square minus 2xy in descending power of one variable and then you are arranging in the terms of x so x has to be first here. Now same way how do you get x, x square how with what should you multiply the prime, primary aim is to bring it to equal to x square. So x multiplied by x gives you x square yes now this also has to be multiplied yeah minus y into x is minus xy okay now again comes the turn of subtraction yeah when we subtract this cancels minus 2xy plus xy becomes minus xy and this another term comes down as it is plus y square don't change the sign of this okay because it is not uh, in, in the lower term lower expre uh, expression okay this comes now we have to bring x minus y we have to bring x x y with what should I multiply x to get minus x y now not plus x y so you will multiply by minus y yes with minus y when I multiply I get minus x y and minus y into minus y is plus y square okay now again we subtract when we subtract children this subtraction this cancels plus y square and minus y square also cancels again we get the quotient as x minus y and the remainder is 0 you will learn in the next class you will also learn x minus y into x minus y which is x minus y the whole square is equal to x square minus 2xy plus y square you multiply this yes you multiply these two the this that is the quotient into divisor gives you plus remainder is 0 since gives you the dividend you can apply this and you will get this as the answer okay understood now when the expression is in two variables in any one x to the power 2 then x to the power 1 voila term and then y square comes okay but when it is in one variable when it was in one variable algebraic expression in one variable then the highest power of x and if the powers in between are missing what have we done we have written it as 0x square and 0x okay understood we have to, you can get a remainder don't worry that if you don't if everything does not cancel here you may get a remainder in some questions. Try them. Thank you.